Hey guys, today we are playing this completely random custom zombies map because why the hell not? Uh, let's just get straight into this. Uh, so this map's called the Pro Rainbow Challenge. It's kind of an annoying map, but oh well. What you gonna do? Um, yeah, 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 it's, it, it has, it's, it's really difficult to get around map. I mean, this door's literally 1,500 after 1,000 door that didn't actually take me anywhere. Thing is, if I shoot these boxes, they give me points, but that one doesn't for some reason. It's kind of annoying. Oh, sick, that was an infinite ammo thing. Um, oh, sick, that one gave me enough points to fly through here. Ooh, another rainbow chicken. Oh god, let's get this shotgun. Um, honestly, everything is too expensive in this map. If this is little more than extortion. I say that, I mean the doors are too expensive and there's too many doors. Your numbers mean nothing. So it's like kinda hard to survive really. Everything's pretty much set up against you. Lovely. Don't I don't even have Crook Revive yet. Crook Revive's actually over there. I should go get that. Uh, okay, let's try not to die first. Um, right. I really want to get to the box because right now I don't want this gun. Not the taste of defeat. And of course, there's another door already. I just spent like a bucket load of cash on the previous door, and now I gotta save up to splash out for the next door. It's, it's not, uh, it's... Honestly, they should have made it cheaper, but that's why they call it a challenge. What's the point in calling it a pro rainbow challenge without it being a challenge, am I right? Yeah, woo! Even though it's the worst, most tedious challenge, it's too expensive. Well, it's not the worst or most tedious. It's just pretty damn tedious. I will fight my way out of any situation. Ah, and I'm dead. Yeah, this map is so difficult. Honestly, I wish I could skip that every single time. I wish I could skip this every single time. Like, seriously, why does it play the forest all the time? Who cares about the forest? The music. I have a lot of maps downloaded. Like, I really should play some of these. Like, Shadows. <laughs> um, Hell Trenches. Not too bothered with that. The Walking Dead. Alexandria. Nectar and Turk. Not really. McDonald's, ooh, should do that, should do that, did that, should do a video on that, that one's a really small map, that one's a pretty fun one, this one's decent, this one's interesting-ish, this one's interesting-ish, this one's eh, not even sure if I've actually played uh, this particular one yet, and you got that, I haven't actually played that one either, Love this one. This one's pretty cool because it's actually an official Treyarch zombie map, as well as this one. 
The only thing is, uh, you'll ne almost none of you will have played them because they're the DS. And then, of course, Pro Rainbow Challenge. Let's go back into this, but this time we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to do something a little bit different. I will show you what we will do in about a second. I'm gonna mod a, like this. Just going to mod it. Okay. Do you think encircling Tokyo is a wise move, foul demons? See, you know what they say: when you use cheats, you always win. But when you always win, you never win. Totally ripping a line from what's it called? Oh, what is it called? It's the Incredibles or something, where it's like when everyone's super, no one is, or something like that. When everyone's super, no one will be. Yeah. Oh, sick dingo. Bracky. So power up my way through the map. Don't even care about what's going on around me. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, Like, I mean, have I even made it to power yet? How would someone actually be able to survive this without using my amazing cheats? See, there's power. But then it's like the entire map just breaks down for some reason. And you can actually turn the power off. And I'm not really sure why. But I need to collect up all these chickens so that I can get through here to pack a bunch. Because there is a wall here. Literally no reason for the wall. I'm gonna pack a bunch now. And it's a go out crow if you pack a bunch camo. Here's the thing though, you go up here, right? You actually just slide back into spawn. But here, it's like here, you're fine. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine, and then slip. Honestly, I want to test out who's who. Because, I mean, it's only round one. What can go wrong, right? Oh yeah, that's right. I'm still in god mode. Survival in this cursed place may be impossible without ammo. Oh boy, I'm not dead. This who was always so useful. Because now I have absolutely nothing and I have to save myself, even though I have nothing that I can actually use to do so. How handy. I mean, there's all these zombies in my way, so obviously I'm going to succeed every time. Like seriously, why did they think who's who was a good idea? Also, the Wonder Fizz is broken in this. Also, I might as well just fly outside of the map, get down, fall into the map again, throw loads of these things for no reason. Fly outside the map, fly so high above the box, like come down on the box, and then. 
Where is the box? It's right here, right? Yeah. Funny badger. Burning demon One of the good guns from Ghost, even though Ghost was bad all the way through. The Raven Mark III, the one gun that does not make a single goddamn sound in custom zombies. A sniper rifle that no one cared about ever. That one gun that everyone thought was going to be cool, but then turned out to be really old. Trying to be cool. Like an old man can't try to be cool, an old man can only be young when he's young. You know what I mean? Like, you can only have the, the thing where it belongs, because, like, in the ear it belongs in, because then it fits in. And it's not the old man who's trying too hard to fit in sort of deal. You know what I mean? Oh well. I'm just gonna shoot that. Oh boy, that was super useful. Ah, oh. uh, playing so legit. Ah, uh, playing so legit. Don't even care. Ah, uh. like yeah, they can just come through these gaps. They don't even have to care. Oh look, another chicken. Thing is, I'm actually now outside the map. They wanted to make the map appear bigger than it was, so they added extra layers out here. Also, that's actually this thing gone now, I did it. Yay. Wonder, considering they can get all the way from there to here, can they come out here? I mean, I feel like they will. Oh no, they won't. What the hell? That is peculiar. Huh. I did not expect that. Whee! <laughs> yeah, it's a good map, guys. It's a good map. In other words, I actually hate this map so much. It's such a bad map. Thanks for watching guys, if you disagree with my hatred for this custom zombies map, please comment down in the comment section below, you know. Also tell me, do you agree with me when I say Gorad Krovi is actually the worst official map in Black Ops 3 Zombies, and then Shangri-La is the worst map in Black Ops 1 Zombies? Yep, S saying what I'm feeling. Cause I hate, I hate the rainbow thing right now. So thanks for watching, guys, and goodbye.